Today, I'm gonna be doing the impossible. I'm gonna go shopping for an endgame keyboard. And I'm accompanied Hippiotech, who will also be shopping for his. We'll be talking about the ins and outs of what we look for. How do you even buy one? And why the heck are they so expensive? Mech group buys. They have okay. 17 live keycap group buys and seven live keyboard group buys. This is a lot. The most interesting seems to be like the Gentleman 65 or the Vertex yeah, angle. I agree. Those are mm. definitely the clean. Gentleman 65 suited edition. When I first saw this, I thought it was a Mr. Suit, but it's not. It's not a Mr. Suit. Now that I've seen a lot of people use Mr. Suits, I really want Mr. Suit. Oh, Squatchy did a Gentleman 65 build. Oh yeah, there it is. I just want a sound test. That's not bad, but that's... I don't know if that's endgame. I don't know what configuration he's using, but the other one sounded pretty good. Like the top one. Hmm. Maybe it's a little too deep. I don't know. It doesn't have that body mm. that like you'd want the from a really premium keyboard. How much is it? Is it premiumly priced? Yeah. 265. It, is. it starts at 265 before add-ons. That is expensive. But I wouldn't say the design is necessarily like premium. It's got a burger top mount or plateless mounting. I like burger mount. This keyboard is not bad. I I feel like I would like it, but it's not it's not anything different than what I already have other than the yeah. knob it's got a nice backside it doesn't scream uniqueness it, it looks like a 65 percent rectangle hear me out the vertex angle looks cooler oh this one is much higher priced than that other one. Oh yeah this is very nice how do i look at the backside i need these are real prototypes that they have here right they're not just know. renders yeah, I hope they're real. If you're selling something, you would have pictures that adequately show what you're selling, right? Especially if it's over $500. If I want the PVD stainless steel weight gun metal, I want to see it. Show me the gun metal. I feel like this could have been something. And it, we were so close. They didn't let it become anything. Quick clack, what's going on? I'm disappointed. One product photo in 2022. More pictures in the Geek Hack thread? Ooh. Ugh, I said I'd never go back to this website it makes you want things that you don't usually want the pictures are nice okay oh the backside looks really good it looks really good why did they not <laughs> show that in any <laughs> it looks great yeah i mean it's nice it's a keyboard it's a rectangle it is a rectangle is it hot swap no it's solder only oh <laughs> why i don't know no there's typing test it doesn't sound very remarkable though oh you're right it doesn't sound good it sounds good, just not amazing. The vertex angle is promising. The no hot swap is a bit of a disaster. Uh, I know. It's 2022. If it's not hot swap, it's, I'm not uh, gonna yeah. hot drop 500 bucks. No, it, it's a no. It's a no for me. A no for me. What about the Dolores? It's almost 600. Oh, that's sad. They sell a full kit for $1,600. Oh, gosh. What did you say your budget was originally? Like 1200 $1, So I can't <laughs> even afford this. <laughs> uh, you got any kidneys to sell? <laughs> no, I got a left pinky toe. That's pretty good. Not a right pinky toe, though. They might take it. Just the left one. No. Wait, wait, wait. So they say it's the complete kit, right? And I'm looking at their website. It says complete kit. Dolores complete kit. Just add switches, stabilizers, and cat. <laughs> wait. <laughs> what do you mean it's a complete kit then? It's not a complete kit. What? I feel cheated. They sell the bottom half for 800 bucks and the top half for 800 bucks. Oh, heck no. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, but it looks pretty. It looks very pretty. End game. Somebody's telling me Freebird TKL is what we should look at. 240 though. Not terrible. That's not terrible. I was expecting with what people were telling me it was going to be cheaper. Oh, a more budget TKL. The Freebird mm. is supposed to be good quality and affordable. Oh yeah, JU says it's the best TKL you can buy for 225. How does it sound? Though? Yeah, how does it sound? If you oh, buy God, it now, God. you get it in Q2. That's barely a wait. Ooh, hold on. The sound, though. 
Yeah, it's, honestly, I think the Freebird is kind of it. It does sound really good, especially for the price, too. That sounds really good. For 240 bucks, that could be endgame. That could be five endgames. <laughs> well, I guess with the money saved on the keyboard, instead of buying a $600 keyboard, you should spend the money on keycaps and get some type of, like, GMK resale, maybe? Oh, yeah, that's right. I forgot. The budget includes not just the keyboard, but all the other things, too. If you had to pick one of these colors, which would you pick? I'd probably choose white because white is a lot more versatile for different keycap sets. Mm -hmm. I was thinking the same. I really like the olive, but it's too olive-y. Like it would match my hoodie, but yeah, I get what you're saying. It's a bit too olive-y. It needs to be maybe more muted olive. Let's say we get a Freebird TKL. I mean, I'm seriously considering it with how it sounds for the price. Yeah. These are nice. Ooh, it comes with Duroc stabilizers. You don't even need to buy separate stabilizers. Freebird, don't thaw. Lock, bro? I don't know how I feel about that. I need to listen to that sound test again. It's definitely got some kind of pop. It's that type of sound that you're like, oh, this is Fiel Holy Panda Sound Test. Teha Types ASMR, you know? Yeah, it, it sounds nice. Okay, so let's say we start our build We've with got the Freebird free bird. TKL. So it'll be $240. Probably polycarbonate. Yeah, yeah, I would go for that. If we're going for thaw. But then we've got to think switches and keycaps. We have stabilizers. GPT Doggy sort of cute. It's super cute. Look at that Corgi Enter. Oh my god. Gosh. Yeah, PBT Doggy is a fantastic set. I feel like I need this. And it's in stock. Ooh. You go with the dog set? No, I can't decide on it right now, but I like it. I like it a lot. I think I might go with this Enjoy PBT. They have a, a nice black on white kit. That would be ultra basic though, if I went for the Freebird TKL. Does Endgame mean we need to flex on somebody? Or does Endgame just mean like we're finally at inner peace? Yeah, you're at inner peace and whenever you look at another group buy, you think, I don't need to buy anymore. Hennessy isn't on sale. Yeah, Hennessy is not on sale. Hennessy is clean. Hennessy is really clean. I just built a board with GMK Hennessy. But it's... GMK doesn't sound doggy. I think doggy is going to be the play all right. here. All right. You. I think I've got I've got my options. If I had to pick something today, I think this would be it. What switches are you going with? Garon Pro Milky Yellows. <laughs> oh, let's go. <laughs> I think that's a pretty fair build then. No, I think this would sound amazing. Well, now do we have to freaking get them or? I mean, it depends. Is this in reality? Could this actually be your end game keyboard or is there something better to look out for. I think for me, my end game has to be a 75%. I don't think I could be happy using a TKL every day. Yeah, I think I would have to using... move it or twist yeah. it or do something wonk to it. No, TKLs just, there's so much space that's wasted. Just to make it look fancier. It is know. quite classy though. Has Hippio made the Nintendo Switch joke yet this stream? No, I stayed strong. What are your favorite Switches? Oh, Betty, <laughs> <laughs> my favorite Switch is the Nintendo Switch. <laughs> 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 okay, well, we got a keyboard, Betty. We do, and we sort of have a combination of things that could do good together. I think it would work as a build, and I think it would be thoughty. Yeah, I think it would be too, and it probably would sound pretty dang good. I think we could maybe build it at some point. Not right now, not yeah, right now. Yeah, not right now. All right, short stream today, y'all. Short stream. It was fun. I like having just conversations about things. It's like we're real people that actually shop for keyboards. We're real people. <laughs> People. We swear, guys. Sometimes we swear. we're real people and not just fake people on the internet. Iconic collab, they said. Maybe next time we could look at like Geek Hack or Reddit. Oh, somebody's saying user submissions. That could actually be really fun. Yeah, my chat loved it. They like seeing what's in stock. They like learning a few things here and there. Check out Hippio Tech if you haven't already. He is linked down below. And we're definitely going to make this a recurring thing since it was re really fun for me and you. And be sure yeah. to check out merch. Check out merch. Goodbye. Buy the merch.